Hi guys, Steve Good here with the Scroll Saw Workshop. I'm here tonight to give you just a real quick tip on how to print the patterns you download from my blog without wasting a lot of printer ink. One complaint I get uh, pretty often is that I include this title page and generally also have uh, some color pictures of the finished project on the second page. And a lot of people write to me in the email and say that uh, this wastes a lot of their printer ink when they print out my patterns because of this and they want me to take the title page off. And I really don't want to do that because that's my branding and it's important to me that I have it on there. But the good news is there's a way around this. You do not have to print these pages when you print the book. If you bring up my pattern book and go up here to the printer icon and click it, it'll open up this print dialog screen. And there are some selections on here that allow you to do different things. Here in this print range section right here, you can print just the current page, uh, the current view, the current page, pages. In this case, the book is six pages long, so it said if I click right now, it'll print pages one through six. Um, so what you can do is, let's say you want to skip the title page and also the pictures and go straight to the first page of the pattern right here. If you bring this pattern page up, click on your printer and then click current page, it'll change the display over here to that page. Now when you click OK, it will print just that single page. You also have the ability to click on pages and in this case you could uh, print pages 3 through 6 by typing 3 minus 6 in there and uh, then when you hit the OK button it's just going to print the pages that you want printed. So just a quick tip there to keep you from uh, using up all your printer ink. Do not print the title page or the color photos uh, if you don't particularly want them. Uh, just print out the pages that you need to make the pattern with. Hope this helps you guys a little bit, and we'll see you next time at the Scroll Saw Workshop.